Oh, hi there, Captain Gujon here, and welcome to Prison Architect. I've been playing a lot of prison games recently, by a lot I mean The Escapists, so one. But anyway, I've been watching a load of like prison movies too, and just cutting it short of actually murdering someone and going to jail. I thought I'd play this to appease my need for penitentiary action. It's going to be sweet. This is Prison Architect, like I say, and it's exactly what it sounds like. You are a prison architect, obviously. Your aim is to build a prison and do that sort of stuff. I've played a little bit already because it, it was a little bit more complicated than I thought, but it's actually pretty straightforward after playing for like half an hour. So we're going to start from the top. And we're going to keep things on the old cheap. And you need to read the CEO's letter. This guy looks like Colonel Sanders. Good lad. I like his beard and his mustache. So first of all, you've got to hire a warden. Then you've got to make jail cells. Then you've got to do kitchen and then showers and water and electrics. So everything runs. Awesome. I love building games. They are potentially one of my favourites. So we're going to start with we're going to start with the warden's office. Uh, not going to make it too massive since we haven't got a huge budget, but in time we shall make more money and build much bigger shit. Next, building a jailhouse. Build a big old room to stick all my criminals in. We'll not have it connected to the warden because we don't want to get murdered in his sleep. And we'll do it. We'll do it. Sixteen by sixteen. Seems reasonable. Also requires an entrance, you don't fucking say. This one needs a jail door. Or a large jail door. Excellent. I want them to know their place. Lovely. We're going to have a bit of an outdoor prison, I think, because we know we like people to have their free time to play basketball and get shivered behind the leeches. Standard stuff, really. Alongside having the warden's office, it does need to have some kind of floor surface. I'm going to treat him to a nice bit of... Nice bit of wood. Nice big bit of wood. You're welcome, Warden. He's going to need somewhere to sit as well, I imagine. And... Get my chair. We need to assign... Also, you have to assign the rooms. So, you know exactly what each room is for. Where is it? Rooms, there it is. Oh, my cell block's finished already. Man, these Mexicans work fast. Must be on hourly rate. Let's make that into an office. So I need a desk, office chair, a desk, and a filing cabinet for office stuff. Let's decorate the cell block. Yay, cell block. Prisoners can have oh, outdoor only. Oh. I was kind of having to give them some nice... Some nice gravel to walk on in their bare feet, because I'm just a nice guy. I'm going to go for metal flooring, because it's cheap as chips. Boom. That was exceptionally expensive. Next on the cards, I think I'm going to build some set a sexy shower block with loads of windows in, since we want people's pride to be shattered to pieces, since this is prison, after all. So, 7x7. Seven seven, we'll do 8x8. Eight eight. And then the dining room can be just a touch smaller. Excellent. Need more doors. Doors. God damn you, doors. So, I don't want them getting into the showers and everything they want. We have only so much water to use, so... Make the best of it, chaps. Lovely. It's coming together nicely. I also need some kind of power plant to run everything, obviously. Power station. You can go there. Water station. You can go there. Should I put them? Oh, I'm going to put them elsewhere, actually. Let's put them behind the warden's house, since that seems like the safest place for them. Don't see inmates going in and putting dicks in the wires or anything like that. We all know what prisoners are like. Stupid. Is there any prisoners watching this video? I'm sorry. I'll see you in court. Great stuff. So you can have kitchen and canteen in one room. I'm, I'm saving space already. I feel like I'm working at a little chef. Why does that man have a light in his mouth? What are you doing? Take that light bulb out of your mouth. Why can't I make... Oh, I've got to put flooring in. What flooring have I got in here? Is that vinyl? Light? I just... Why can't I do that? I'm com what am I missing here? I need to really run power cables into all of this too. 
so much to do. And I've only got nine hours before my prisoners get here. Tits. I don't think I have enough power to do all this. Scheisse. Right, okay, we need to run some more electrical cables. So you have to do all the substations and all the underground stuff too, which is actually really cool. I thought it was quite terrifying to start with, but it's actually not too bad. And some to the warden's office too. Speaking of the warden's office, probably should hire a warden. That was one thing I forgot last time and I realised I couldn't actually afford. I need a toilet in here as well. We're going to have like a nice row of toilets just by the kitchen door since that seems to fit the hygiene standards. Can't have urinals for fear of reach arounds. What else do we need? You know what? I don't want to have smart inmates, so we're just going to give them a weights bench. Just for the toilet, so while you're taking a dump, you can watch some guys pump iron. Perfect. It's coming together nicely. Warden. Need to hire a warden. Awesome, there he is. Hello. you got a, fine, a damn fine mustache. Could do the comb over though. They would completely finish the pedophile look. Are they gonna are they gonna fit these power cables or what? We have five hours till these goddamn prisoners get here, guys. Get your shit together. How hard are your jobs? And why is there no water from anywhere else? Definitely safe to run my electrical cables through my water pipes, right? Why have you guys not escaped yet? You've been stood outside for literally 12 hours. You could have run away quite easily. Everyone inside, please. Everyone inside, please. Why won't you go inside? Why won't you go inside? You're all hungry. Go inside and eat. This is why I am not an architect in prison. This is exactly why. Please tell me that's not another eight prisoners. Because I only have eight beds. I'm definitely not building any more because... There's eight beds there for a reason. Come on. Please don't be more prisoners. Please don't show me any more prisoners. Now there's 16 prisoners I can't fucking feed. Jesus Christ. So I started again because that was an absolute failure. Exactly the same build. Just made the kitchen a little bit bigger this time since as much as I'm a cheapskate, people gotta eat. I used to be a chef so I respect that. This food is goddamn delicious. I just bought these tables. Literally. Just bought these tables. And the second hand. I did not pay. A hundred dollars. Mm, that's kind of fair enough, really. I'll pay a hundred dollars for a dirty table. Any time of the week. I'm going to really cram them in. That's what she said. But seriously, though. I really am. And I'll put a toilet on the next to every bed. So in the middle of the night, if you hear splashing water, don't look to your left. It's someone taking a huge dump. I'm all about space management and saving as much space as we can. And saving as much money as we can so my warden can buy himself a nice midlife crisis. By that I mean a Porsche or a Jag. One of the two. Why haven't they fit the... They've just kind of... They've done little bits of cabling, but not all of it. Look, where the fuck's the logic in that? Come on, guys, you're better than this. I don't pay you 50 cents an hour for this kind of work, do I? Jesus. Cannot get the staff for an incredibly low wage. The prison's up and running, and it's opening day. It's opening day, I and mean, I guess it gets kind of up and running. I think last time my mistake was actually not hiring any guards to take the prisoners inside, so now they're just gonna... Come on, Evans, bring your mustache. A female guard. Jesus Christ, it's just like Gamergate, but... without the video games. That kind of makes sense. See, so yeah, hopefully this will all actually work now. But I just cannot work out why the fucking power station keeps turning itself off. What a dick. I want to say my little prison is up and running, but I'm not sure that it is just yet. This has been Prison Architect. I'm going to do a bit more research and swap a little bit and find out how everything works for the next video. And we're going to do shitloads more then. But yeah, as I say, if you like this shit, like this shit. Share, subscribe, do what you got to do. And until next time, Captain Gujon, out.